Good morning, my Pisces collective. I hope you're having a wonderful day. What's up, Pisces? Here you can ring my bell. Ring my bell. Ring a ling a ling. Okay, Pisces, what you all got going on? God protects me and God fights my battles. No weapon formed in spirit or physical against me shall prosper. I'm highly favored and protected from all evil, as is my beautiful Pisces. Collected Pisces, what's going on? But Pisces, wait a minute, because this card in the back wanted to do something. Let's just take a peek. Oh my God, Pisces, what the fuck? Ugh. Two of Swords, Five of Wands, and the Five of Swords. Damn, Pisces, what the what the hell? But Pisces, I feel like you Zen as fuck right here. I'm seeing the King of Pentacles and the Ten of Cups. So we got someone here that's in a relationship, partnership, wants to come towards you, but someone's in their head. Yeah, someone's been cut the fuck off, okay? Someone's been called a fool, and someone acted like a fool. So you had to move the fuck away from them. Oh my God, yes you did. Yes you did. Spirit told you to leave this person out in the fucking cold. Spirit said, nope, you don't need this person. Go find you a new wand to play with. Two of, two of pentacles with the knight of pentacles. Yeah, go go find you something better. Go find you a sweet someone better. Now we got a Knight of Cups and this uh, Knight of Pentacles. Um, are you gonna have two fighting over you, Pisces? What the fuck here? And then I see an Emperor, y'all. We gonna peek. We gonna peek. Yeah, and then you got an Emperor here. Ace of Pentacles with the Ten of Pentacles. Damn. This is like, this is like beautiful energy right here. Um, okay, Pisces, that's three. Okay. Uh, definitely some conflict here. Uh, you've moved away from somebody, so you're out of a situation. You're getting a new start, and now you maybe you're deciding which one of these you want to go towards. For some of you, there's an emperor hiding in the background. You just ain't seen it yet. Spirit, that's part of that will of fortune energy. You just haven't met this person yet. This person's got their shit together. This is, this is, yeah. This person's got their shit together. Now, if this ain't in love, this could be in work. Uh, I gotta say love, because here's the lovers. The Nine of Pentacles and the King of Cups with the Queen of Cups sitting right here. And the Seven of Pentacles. Some of you have been waiting for this, Pisces. I got to tell you. Now, y'all know I don't do this love reading shit all the time. That's love. The Lovers, the Nine of Pentacles, King of Cups, Queen of Cups, and the Seven of Pentacles. But you see the Queen of uh, Pentacles, or Queen of Cups right here is looking over here. So you, you haven't met this person, but they're going to be your match. With that emperor in that uh, King of Cups energy, this emperor, uh, if they're not an Aries, could be uh, more of a water sign. They're at least going to be a, a rather emotional person. So they're going to meet you on your emotional level. Because it feels like your money and shit's together, right? Uh, you're just... Um, wow. They're going to make you a fucking empress. Damn, Pisces. Fuck, your reading's done. I don't want to fuck that up. <laughs> Pisces! That's beautiful. What else do you have for my Pisces collected? Please and thank you, Spirit. Pisces. Please and thank you, Spirit. What's going on here? What's going on, Pisces? I seen 412. That could mean something for somebody. Pisces, what's up? <laughs> There's that Ace of Wands again. New start. New start. New start. Crowned by the... What did I say? New start. So, you know, the Two of Wands there at that Ace of Wands goes to the Three of Wands. So some of y'all, if you've been wanting to start something, you've been looking forward to starting something, it's going to lead into that, okay? So if you're feeling a little stagnant, this almost feels like if you want to wait a minute, it's like you're going to be in the Three of Wands uh, energy anyway, uh, just waiting, 
just waiting. Y'all hear the train whistle? So that right there tells you. You're waiting, but it, it's eventually going to be coming in, okay? So it goes to that three of wands type energy. So what's beneath this situation? Knight of Swords. It's like you heard something to get you to move away from a situation. Uh, you could have... Uh, for some of you Pisces, this could have been a situation that kind of had you stuck for a hot minute, right? That's why you are now ready to get the fuck on. But you had to stay stuck. You had to stay put. You had to do something. You were kind of stuck. But uh, this is probably more in your head than what it was like literally. Here's that Ace of Cups. Uh, Pisces, the... Ace of Wands, the Ace of Cups, and the Ace of Pentacles has showed up, along with an Emperor. So, whatever energy you're operating in, Pisces, you need to keep staying in that energy. The Star card. Keep doing the healing, okay? Keep loving yourself. Keep giving to yourself. 555 on the phone. Do the work. And then you can expect the unexpected. The more love and nurturing you give to yourself the better your opportunity is, right? Put that love and time and attention in yourself. Don't waste it crying over somebody, okay? Don't waste it being stuck, feeling like you're stuck in a situation. And a lot of you, this is just that mental prison, right? Where you feel like, oh, I'm never going to find love again. I'm never going to find somebody as good as them. Yeah, you will. There's always a better version of whoever the fuck you're waiting on, okay? Three of Wands energy. But you come through some shit, though. I mean, you know, if it wasn't bad for you, you felt it bad. You It had you definitely all caught up in your head and your emotions. King of Pentacles, Two of Pentacles with this big-ass Ace of Pentacles. Here we go again with this Ace of Pentacles energy. Balance is definitely going to show up. But this is like when you when it's time for you to take action with that two of wands, you're going to know what the fuck to do. You're going to be able to make the correct judgment call. Give to the situation that you need to. So Pisces, I don't I don't want you worried about anything. Just focus on your healing. Focus on doing you. Uh, who's this star energy? The sun, the sun, moon, and stars. Someone probably sees you as being their sun, their moon, and their stars. That emperor energy. They think you're the bee's knees, Pisces. <laughs> What's this Ace of Cups energy about? The Three of Wands. I told you the Three of Wands would show up. Some of you have just been... I don't think you've been waiting on it. You've kind of maybe been feeling it come in. You know, I keep telling you all you got to have that heart chakra open. But if you want to call in love... Um, you know, and you can do that by just loving everything around you, right? Sending that peace, love, and light out to everybody, y'all. It ain't horse shit. It works. Eight of, uh, swords here to the page of wands. <laughs> Again, with the one, two, three, with the wands energy, which we got 11, 11 here with the page of wands, the ace of wands, and that two of wands, right? Divine timing, divine timing, y'all. Give it time, and spirit will bring it. When you do the healing, with the star there and the sun, this is like the shadow work, okay? You're loving yourself. You're giving to yourself. You're drinking plenty of water. You're staying grounded. All that beautiful energy. And that is how you overcome your obstacles. This knight of swords energy. What or who the fuck were you dealing with down here? Well, two wanted to come out, so let's see what they are. A king of wands with this uh, ten of cups. Uh, this could have been someone that maybe you were thinking about this. I feel like you were thinking about this. <laughs> For some of you, this could be someone coming towards you. Because I'm drawn to this King of Wands. This Ten of Cups, starting out as a page energy, how are they going to reach you? This could have been how they showed up to you before. Or this could be the energy that they are in. And now they're looking to call in love. Um, damn, right? Some of y'all could be like mirroring each other's energy. Okay? Um, 
So Pisces, keep your fucking energy clear. Do everything you can to get out of any negative mindsets. Because this, all these wands is about action. Action, getting ready to take place. Action, someone getting ready to come in and make the move to make the to make the changes that they need to to make the offers that they need to. Wow. Now, Pisces, this could be your energy and you're taking these steps. This could be someone taking these steps towards you. You know, you could be going towards somebody. Over this Ace of Wands, we got the Queen of Swords. So this is this is thinking logically with the Nine of Swords. Yeah, so this is coming from any past negative energies. You're cutting that shit out. If you're not, you need to cut that shit out. You need to be looking at new growth, positive new energy. Okay? You cut that... No stinking thinking around here, okay, Pisces? You cut that shit out and you think a positive. This is also that Queen of Swords protecting that, like, sapling, okay? Uh, so you're protecting any new starts that you have. Or someone is protecting any new starts that they got. Because we got judgment down here as above, so below. So this um, Two of Wands energy, Five of Cups, no stinking thinking. Pisces? Ooh. Pisces, I went tired before I started this reading, so get plenty of sleep. The fool card. You a fool if you fuck up this opportunity. How about that, Pisces? You'd be a fool if you fucked up this opportunity. So some of you are. Are you not sleeping? Are you worried about something? Because it don't look like you need to be worried about anything. Remember, the energy that you operate in, the energy that's around you is the energy that you attract. So if you stay stuck in this sad kind of woe is my life type energy, then your life's going to be a woe is my life type energy. Whereas if you're at least you get up, you greet the morning, thank the good Lord up above, you're drawing another breath of air and move forward. Get out of this stinking thinking. Are you going to fuck up your situation? That's the judgment call. That's the judgment call. As above, so below. As above, so below. You want positive energy around you? You you operate in positive energy. You do this stinking thinking and you're going to be a fool and fuck up an opportunity that you could uh, miss out on. You have a choice. You could either sit there and moan and groan or you could just take an opportunity. Don't be a fool and stay stuck in that energy. Be a fool and, and go towards something new and positive. Yeah, so Pisces, I mean, honestly, I don't know. Ooh. Get some fucking sleep, Pisces, okay? I like this, because look, here's that Queen of Wands. Balance being brought in. Some of you are going to meet your king of wands. Someone could be bringing it in. Some of you could have already met this person. Okay. Uh, and maybe you're still kind of doubting it. This is a person that takes action. I don't see this as being past energy. This is someone new. Could definitely be heavy on the fire sign energy. So uh, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. I am seeing this king of pentacles. So they could have a little bit of earth in them. Keep keep doing the healing, man. Keep thinking positive. No stinking thinking. No stinking thinking, Pisces. Because that's what the judgment's going to be all about. How did you overcome your situation? How did you make it through? What was your mindset through all of it? Well, judgment's called, right? You want to be on the side of this healing, happiness, not on the side of this, stuck in your head, unable to take action. 14, 14 when I said that, which goes down to 5, 5. So, which goes down to 10, which is one and needs new beginnings. So, you know what, Pisces? No stinking thinking. Think positive. Again, you know, this could be you going towards somebody now or somebody coming towards you. You know your energy here. But it, it's time for things to start moving forward. But you got to be in the right mindset, okay? You got to have that heart chakra open. You got to be willing to to bring in whatever good abundance that you want. It's a beautiful reading, Pisces, but no stinking thinking, okay? 
you can ring my bell, ring my bell, ring a ling a ling, and I sing fourteen fifty five also. So Pisces, you want to change your life, change your way of thinking, okay? For those of you that's that's on that healing path and you're trying to find the fucking ray of sunshine, keep it up. Those of you that haven't figured that out yet. Keep working. Keep working on it. It's just a matter of flipping that script around. Knowing that everything is as it should be. And y'all, get some fucking sleep, okay? You're draining my energy. Love you, Pisces.